Hi, I'm Lainey, and I'm going to show you how to triple step in the swing dance or Lindy Hop style. We're going to work on a rhythm that is triple step. It sounds like, which is one, a two. So we want our rhythm to have this swung beat, as we call it. It's a syncopated rhythm. So our rhythm is not equal on the three different steps. We would have instead of one and two, we're looking at one and two. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a little jump. We're gonna give our feet a little wider than our shoulders. We want our knees to fall over our toes. And we're just gonna keep our knees nice and bent, stick our butt behind us. We'll have a little bit of a bounce. And we're gonna start with our right foot and we're just going to take our really basic rhythm. We'll have right, left, right. And then we're gonna stand on that right foot. Now we're gonna take that to the left and we have left, right, left. And when we finish each step, we want to make sure our knees are still nice and soft. And we still have that bounce in our bodies. So we're going to try that again on the right. We would have right, left, right. And then on the other side, we have left, right, left. So we can also take this as a repeating rhythm to start to feel some of the cadence of the step. And we can take this on the right foot going right and right and right and right. And then to the left left and left and left and left. So we'll have this step going one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and hopefully you don't run out of space. <laughs> and one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight. And now we're gonna take that with four counts. One and two and three and four. One and two and three and four. One and two. One and two, one and two, one and two. And that's actually our triple step, that one and two, one and two. So we're gonna practice that again. We're gonna think about keeping our feet really nice and relaxed. We're actually gonna do the eight counts. Actually, we'll start on the left this time. We'll do eight counts, eight counts, four counts, four counts, two counts, two counts. So we would have five, six, seven, eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, eight, four, one, and two, and three, and four, one, and two, three, and four, one, and two, one, and two, one, and two, one, and two, one, and two. So this is our trip full step, trip full step, trip full step, Trip, full step, trip, full step, trip, full step, trip, full step. We say triple step as in the place of one and two because the rhythm of the words sound like the rhythm of our steps. Trip, full step. We can also think of the step as a long, short, short in rhythm. So we have long, short, short, long, short, short. One, a two, one, a two, trip, full step, trip, full step. And we make sure we just really keep this feeling of pushing into the ground. My knees are bent, my butt is back, and I'm actually on quite a flat foot throughout this step because I'm moving linear. There's no turning or pivoting happening, so I'm not worried about staying over on my tiptoes. In fact, I don't wanna be on my tiptoes because then I'm actually putting too much tension and energy in my calves. So it's okay if your heels do hit the floor. However, be cautious not to allow yourself to fall on your heels and then your toes are actually in the air. So we just wanna stay nice and neutral with our bodies. I'm gonna show it from this angle for the last time. Five, six, here we go. We have trip, full step, trip, full step, trip, full step, trip, full step. And in a faster tempo, these triple steps would look like five, six, Seven, eight, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step, triple step. One, a two, three, a four, five, a six, seven, eight. And that's just the basic triple step. There's lots of directions of triple steps we can practice. I've got that video linked up at the top for my triple step practice drill. I'm Lainey. Make sure you subscribe if you want some more swing dancing tips.